Hey guys, Eric here from Cheap Ass Reviews, and this week we're going to be reviewing the CM1060W Black & Decker coffee maker that I got at Walmart. So yeah, let's do that. <laughs> Backstory on how I got this coffee maker, I went to Walmart, I saw it, I was just cruising down the aisles, and I just had to have it. But first I had to find Miss Cheap Ass Reviews, uh, so she could take my picture. And a better version. Then I saw Pikachu, great guy. And while throwing the coffee maker into the cart, I realized I gotta get some cereal. <laughs> so I did that. But let's talk about this coffee maker. The clock is a beautiful shade of vile green and will blend into any kitchen nicely. One feature I'm particularly enamored with is that you can pour yourself a cup of coffee thanks to a spring mechanism thing. And this comes in handy when you just gotta have some coffee, but don't drink too much or you'll be running circles around your house. But for you, that's a good thing, because now you get to see a 360 degree view of the coffee maker all the way around. Beautiful. Real beautiful. This is how you program the damn thing. You hit the program, then you hit the minute or the hour, whatever, to get to where you want it to be, and then you hold down the auto. Now a short film about making coffee. Typical Saturday morning at the Cheap S Reviews house. Got a little local coffee, a filter. We're gonna put it in the pot and fill her up with water. That is a very important step when you're brewing coffee. You put it in the back of the machine, shut the lid, and turn her on. Turn her on. Okay, now you start brewing, and this is where things start to just get delectable, delightful, and just great because it smells like coffee in your house. You're pouring yourself a cup, you're pouring them a cup. Put an ice cube in for them because they have a weak tongue. Pour in a little cream for yourself. Good job. Then you're gonna set it on the table. Ready to enjoy. A good cheers to that. And I did. Delicious. I'm a male model. You know, I've been getting a lot of feedback lately about how I don't provide enough information in my videos. So I'm gonna make a little bit more of an effort. Let's start with the branding. Black & Decker is spelled B-L-A-C-K, and then a plus symbol, then D-E-C-K-E-R. And it's written in gray, and it lies down gently on a bed of semi-gloss white plastic. The coffee maker is about 11 inches tall, and it's about 5 or 6 inches wide, and it's about 9 inches deep. God, that was exhausting. I'll see you next Thursday. All right guys, thanks for watching my review of this Black & Decker coffee maker. If you liked it, you can do whatever you want with the comment, share, subscribe, uh, click the affiliate links in the video description, and I'll see you next Thursday. <laughs> you want, because it's Thursday, and tomorrow is, wait, there's only Thursdays, huh? There's no, every day's a Thursday.